Good morning. Hello and welcome. Um, welcome to uh, Kitty Cat Central here. They are all hanging out. Today's a full moon. Um, they are even feeling the energy. They're in and out and running around. And I have brought the paranormal flashlight back into the reading. So many of you have been asking about it. I was kind of hoping I could get away from it a little bit. But you guys seem to like it. Where are we going, buddy? I gotta have room to lay the cards down. You wanna help? He wants to help. <laughs> All right. I am gonna pull some cards for just what today's energy is. Just bringing the flashlight back in, uh, incorporating that back into the reading again. <clears throat> So as you know, it may come on or off throughout the reading. Either way is a spirit validating that they are in the room and in the conversation. I only work with beings of the light. I follow what is called the Christ consciousness. Um, I believe in God and uh, Jesus, really, because he was the original light worker. Thank you, spirit on light. <clears throat> validating that. Wow. I'm going to tell you what, that is powerful shit there, dude. <clears throat> Um, spirit coming across to validate what I just said about Jesus being the original light worker. Cool. Now, he probably wasn't the original one, <clears throat> but he is the guy that picked it up and ran with it. Also, that's why he was persecuted for it. Um, bam, bam, bam. Let's see what's going on. <clears throat> Today is full moon. Actually, right now. Uh, there are two fives on, on the floor or on the table, on the floor. Um, those fives represent the change that is happening right now in this full moon energy. <clears throat> we are, are literally in the contraction before the expansion. And that's kind of what two fives are. That change. It, it's today, there's going to be points of the day that it feels really stressful, really heavy. And then there are going to be um, moments where that finally breaks open. And we see that expansion. We see that growth. Thank you, Spirit. Uh, five of Swords. You know, it, it was, you have been dealing with a lot of discouragement. Things have not been going your way. It felt like people, it felt like everybody was against you. Um, but you can't, don't try that. It won't work. Um you shouldn't go that way. You shouldn't do that. You know, they were giving you their advice, but it really wasn't helping. That other five is about, you know, you, um, you did the practice. You did the exercises. Um, you literally did the work. And that's why right now we are getting ready to have some fruition um, some manifestation of the things that we have been working towards. We also have the Queen of Swords here. We've been talking about her all week. Thank you, Spirit on Light. Um, sometimes she can be mean and bitchy. Um, she can be forceful. Don't be the mean and bitchy queen. You can be powerful and forceful without being sour and nasty. Don't come at people like, I hate to say the word, use the, the Karen thing, because I know so many good Karens, but don't be that Debbie Downer, okay? If you don't have anything good to say, don't say jack shit. Let it go. Because this is why. We have the Hermit card. If you keep up with the thought process that you have, the negativity that you've been feeling, um, you are afraid that you will be alone. So it is time to turn that sourness, thank you, Spirit, on a light again. It's time to turn that negativity into something a little lighter and easier going. We also have the magician here. Um, and in this particular case, this is talking about, you guys already have everything in your arsenal to do this. Um, you've Not only have you been walking the walk, you've been talking the talk. Um, 
you're learning, you're growing, you're becoming more spiritual. You're reaching out and becoming more kind to other people. Um, <clears throat> extend your smile when you're in the store. You want to be that person that radiates that positive energy. Thank you, Spirit. Wow. See, as soon as I changed my smile, the energy changed the way, just the way it happens. Be contagious. Make people happy. Um, that is our only purpose here on this earth is to be happy, to love, to extend love, to help your, to help your fellow man. Uh, the first rule of ascension is learn how to love with your soul. All right, grabbed another deck. I want to get a couple jumpers here to validate any energies that are going on. <clears throat> One more, please, spirit. And there it is. Wow. Crazy, crazy, crazy how, how stuff happens. All right. Earlier we had two, two fives that jumped out. Now we've got two tens. Uh, we've been going through the fives of the change that we've been going through. We are in that moon right now. Um, that change is going to continue and we are going to wrap up some ugly cycles here. Ten of swords. It's time to put that stuff behind you. Swords are air. Air is thoughts. Um, You've been thinking a lot of negative things about yourself. You've been thinking you can't do it. You've been thinking that there's no way I can accomplish this. Yes, you can. You have, you, you've been putting the work in. We've got the 10 of wands. That 10 is about picking up and moving on to a new chapter. Yep, time to put that old stuff in the background. Be done with it. Be over with it. We also had the nine of swords come up again, the nine and 10 in sequence, letting me know that you guys are on the right track. You are doing that work. You've got the nine there. That nine was that, that, that was all about the anxiety and the depression that you dealt with. <clears throat> it's all about the pain and the agony. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then we have, oh, sorry, kitty. <laughs> then we have the Knight of Swords. All right. He's moving in on a fast horse. You're going to see these changes manifest a lot quicker than you expected. Um, there are going to be some bright, shiny, sunshiny days coming. Keep up the good work. This is awesome. All right, you guys, there you have it. Brief read right in today's full moon. Um, I hope that gives you a little bit of insight how to go about your day. And you know that I never leave you, that I don't bless you with love and light. See you soon.